<sighs> I wonder what I'm gonna do today. A mysterious package! What is going up, you guys? Today it's me, James. I mean, Kinetic Clops. <laughs> so basically, today we got a package. So, what is it? Uh, James, can you, can, you, can you tell me what this box is? So basically, in this box in here, it's the Alternation L Ray figure. So basically, what is alternation? It's like the coolest action figures I've ever seen in my entire life. I don't know, it's so it's like humans, hybrids, heroes. So basically, it's about the GK Delta. They're like these secret uh, animal hybrid heroes. And they're like agents. So basically, they fight the evil villains and stuff. And so I like to just, I, I just like it. I mean, it's really awesome. So these were made from Panty Money Toys. Now, pan so basically, Panty Money Toys, you did a pretty good job at them. I've seen the reviews, they were amazing. So basically, um, they're available on Amazon now. So if you want to get a figure, well, even though it's close to getting to Christmas, you can get your own alternation figure. So basically, the only one I didn't see on Amazon, which was Sabotage the Villain. So, um, if you're looking for that guy, he's, I don't know. But you could ask him for Christmas if you want. So we're going to get opening this figure, and we'll see this. So it's an unboxing video, so I'm going to need, I'm just going to cut the tape so we can get into this. All right. So you guys, let's get into this. I'm almost getting close to get opening this, so maybe I'll just try and open this while I'm holding the camera, even though it's going to be real hard. All right. Okay, so all right, so I got the tape open. So all right, so ready to see the figure, you guys? So let's open this. Oh, oh, there's this glory. Oh yeah, here we go. My first soul turnation figure. We have. Oh, look at this figure. Oh my God, this figure is amazing. I didn't expect him to be that size. So let's see, what's this? Uh, probably can't see that. Get out here, box. Here we have the new Alternation L Ray figure. So basically, let's check out the packaging. So L Ray looks pretty awesome. So basically, we see him in there with all of his weapons and a mini comic, which we'll get into. It. And Alternation L Ray, and it says free graphic novel inside. That's cool. Phase one, uh, ages six and up. So it says, oh, look at this. Uh, electric lightning storm, a uh, flexible stingray tail, and collectible L Ray mini comic. We got a nice artwork of L Ray. That looks pretty cool. And so here it got behind this. So we can read this. L Ray was created by the uh, amphibious. Oh, I can't read that. Soldier able to to breathe and land in water widely. Sorry. Uh, not as large of as some of my other subjects. He makes up for it uh, with. I can't read that. Defense measure taken from the DNA of L eels and catfish, uh, as well as poisonous stingray barb. And so basically, here are the other figures, which we'll get in that in a minute. And so here, right here, this is where. All the animals he's like is, and we got a little puzzle up here, and you like spell the words. We got a nice artwork of L Ray right there, and so right here he's absorbed abilities, infamous dragon bolts. But here we're here for this. How DNA service? So he's human, of course. He's uh manta ray, electric catfish, uh, electric ray, and sailfish and stingray. That's pretty cool. And here we got all the characters you can collect. So basically, of course, we got L Ray right there. And this is Sabotage. So this is the guy. He's like the villain. And he looks pretty awesome. We got... Oh, oops. Focus. We got Elbert Seven. We got Dart. Dart is like the best one. So I can't wait till we get that guy. We got Sham. We got Quillroy. And we got Phase Two. These guys look pretty awesome. So we got Bomber. We got Alpha. Al Actually, Alpha looks pretty dope. So basically... Why don't we stop waiting and get opening this figure? So the packaging is amazing. And so I really how like they really done with the packaging. And so basically, so little El Ray, would you like to get yourself open? He said yes. So let's get you out. 
Alrighty, so here we got this amazing, beautiful, beautiful figure. Now, this is the most beautiful figure I ever had in my collection. So before we get into Elright, let's look at this comic right here. So the comic is well detailed. So we got Elright right there, that amazing artwork. Focus camera, focus, there we go. So basically, uh, when you're like done playing with the action figure, you could just read this if you're like your kid or something. And the art looks amazing on this. Look at that. Is that amazing? Oh my god, like, look at that. <laughs> I, like, it looks like a Marvel comic. Look at that amazing artwork of Elray right, right there. And so basically, you, c I think you, so you can also like get them on pantymonytoys.com. And so here we get into weapons. We got this cannon right here. Don't really know what. He needs can I never seen it in the cartoon yet, so like we just got like I think it was episode four, no episode five, I can't really know. And we're still I'm still waiting for that. That just got like posted like last year. And we also got this little mini gun, it's like a like it's like a, like a little harpoon weapon. That's pretty cool. Come on, focus camera, focus. Yeah, well. And he's got this cool trident and he could like beat Aquaman with this. <laughs> Aquaman sucks. <laughs> so, this is a really, really cool weapon. I actually really, really like it. So, it's kind of hard for the camera to focus. And uh, it's facing on. Hillary. So, this is the harpoon weapon. It's pretty long. So, that's pretty amazing detail. And now we're getting into Hillary. So, I, I got him posed. Now, so, the one thing, the legs are on a ball joint type of thing. So, one thing that I don't really like about El Rey is, like, he was, like, super buff in the, super buff in the, like, kind of, like, super buff in the miniseries, the TV, like, the old web series. But he's not really buff, like, I mean, like, on the action figure. I'm not seeing the figure is bad or anything. So, basically, for the head, it's on a ball. So, you can, like, get him to look up that far. You can make him look down that far. So, you, I think you could, yeah, you could, like, take it off if you want, but I'm not going to take it off. The one thing that's really strange about him is his head. Like, it's really weird. This looks like some type of beard. That's pretty cool. Now, it's kind of sharp up here, so, hmm, oh well. And so, yeah, that's pretty cool. And for the arms, they could go all the way around. I don't really like to do that with my figures. I don't want it to get loose. And the arms could go up that far, they could go down that far. And he's got an elbow bend that far. It can't really go that far. But it, I don't know why. And the hands could swivel. Like, he reminds me of the creature from the Black Lagoon. Like, that's really cool. And so, basically, for the legs, they could, they can't, I mean, they could kind of go for that bar, but it's a <laughs> bar. Yeah, I don't know. And we got the legs can go back that far. So, I don't really like those ball-like hinges, even though some of my figures have that, and even the Marvel Legends. I don't really like it with that, like, the figures, because it makes it kind of loose. And so, for the legs, they could go, like, so for the knee, they could knee, and so they could, sorry, you got you could, his, God, I'm messing up. So, his knee could, and we got a knee joint, I don't know what it's called, forgot. And his feet can go up that far. It doesn't, like, swivel. It just goes up and down. You could get him, like, in swimming poses. And the one thing, he's got a little rubbery tail. So, I don't really recommend for you pulling this, because it might come off. But, so, basically, it kind of bent a bit, how it was packaging. So, for actually Albert Seven, which I do not have him yet. He comes with, like, a bendy tail. So, it would have been cool if, they had, if he had a bendy tail, including Sham. And yeah, that really sucks. So for, but I actually really like it. It's so jiggly. <laughs> Look at that detail. Isn't that amazing? So for this triangle square thing, so you press it and it goes. Come on, focus. And it glows. So that's really cool, but there's no waist swivel, so I kind of wish they had that. But this figure is truly amazing. Pandemonium Toys, you did an amazing job on this figure. I love the detailing on this figure. Like, I'm still waiting for the, another episode. Like, where is it? Like, hey, man, where's the other episode coming? <laughs> so, I love this figure so much. He reminds me of the creature from the Black Lagoon. I mean, I'm asking for the, uh, the other figures for Christmas. But for Alpha and Bomber, I haven't... Like, I'm still waiting for him. I think they're going to come out next year. That's my opinion. 
But, like, Alpha looks really cool. I can't know what the feature is going to be for him. Maybe his tongue comes out. Ooh, that would be gruesome. For Bomber, I think that weird giant green ball, like a weird scorpion ball thing. If it, like, launched, that would be really cool. Like, if you pull back the tail and it goes, whing, like that. But I love this figure. This figure is truly amazing. So let's try and get him to hold his harp. No, 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 his, uh, trident. Whatever it's called. Forgot what it's called. I think it's a trident. So it's going to be really hard, and I hate, uh, like, figures when they have to, like, like those bendy, flexible things. So I'm going to just turn off the camera and do this. Ooh, the camera's not even focused. Hey. Oh, he could only focus on the L ray. Alrighty, so I got El Rey all posed. Looks pretty awesome. So I'm actually worried because the hands are like that weird flexible type of thing. And so basically I just got him like holding it like this. And this is going to go like really great. Like I love how like, he has like the detailing is awesome on this figure. Like, like Panny, like, Panny. This is amazing. Like a truly amazing figure. I cannot wait till I get the other ones. Because Elroy was the first one I bought, and this is a truly amazing figure. So let's try and see if he could, uh, usually I'm not really, I don't really like make him gonna hold, like, these type of parts right here. So, uh, yeah. So let's try and see if he, how he holds the cannon. So let's try and get him to hold it, like, I don't think I'm gonna make him hold the cannon. I'm just gonna make him hold this, because this thing is, I really like this, because it's really amazing. Okay, so thanks for watching, you guys. If you liked this video, I hope you did. I mean, this this figure is really amazing. So like and subscribe and hit the bell like button. Oops. And so if you want to get your own alternation figure, buy it on Amazon and, or Pandemony and PandemonyToys.com. And see you next time, you guys.